Chair caning is an ancient and global craft that dates back thousands of years and spans the globe. Hey, this is Brandy Clements. And I learned the basics from my family, but then you learn with every single chair that you weave. With so many different materials, patterns, and construction elements of chairs, chair caning and seat weaving is a very fun hobby or side hustle. You also learn from 12 years of making mistakes and trying to figure out simpler ways to do things. These rockers are quite common and they're more of an intermediate project, but I think you can do it. So check in the tension to follow this curve here. Just enough. Pull, pinch, pull down and add a peg. Step four can take several hours to weave. Just be patient and keep your grid organized. And step four is done. Weave in a stair step pattern over and under vertical so and horizontal pairs. The cane is running. Bring it backwards and make a big loop. Top sides are up and the top side is in the inside of this U. And then you just pull both sides at the same time. Just draw it sideways. At the last minute, I'll use that, that little pocket. And then it goes right in there, covers the wood, completes the pattern, and there you are. Steps five and six are tricky. Just be patient and keep your cane from twisting. That's the most important part. Even on the binder, your cane will want to twist. So just be patient. You did it. Oh, it looks so great. These chairs are so important. They're older than we are, and they'll be here long after we're gone. And now you become a part of your chair story. Ready for more? Let's take a look at some other chairs you can learn. kind of weaving through like this, then pulling taunt. Warning, you might become a chair nerd. Think you're ready for it? Let's get to work.